Yeah, it's very disappointing. Um, <clears throat> obviously, had a really good start to the day as well, picking up uh, those early wickets and, and being 50 for none. So, um, you know, we let that slip. Uh, it's obviously very disappointing, um, you know, when these happen. And it's uh, important that we can recognise that and why it's happened and to improve that. Yeah, did yeah, obviously. You know, we've seen uh, throughout this series so far, when, when we've had some excellent conditions to bowl in as well, it's, it's um, you know been tough for the batters, and uh, obviously, you know, that, when you get on that momentum as well, it can. Um, you know, when we've been bowling, it felt like we we're going to take a wicket every ball. So uh, it's um, you know comes down to how can you wrestle back the initiative. I think um, you know, a couple of ways, maybe it's a counter-attacking style or something, or someone you know trying to sit in and, and be a bit of a limpet for an hour and ride that, that session out, but uh, obviously we weren't good enough to do that that today and the guys are obviously disappointed with that. Uh, we have to talk about it, but at the same time there's a game going on and no one's going to give up or, or throw the towel in, so um, you know, we, we'll be fighting hard. I think um, we've played some fantastic cricket throughout the series. We're 2-0 up. Um, we've had a poor day today, and that's, that's very disappointing, but we'll dust ourselves down and, and come back hard tomorrow. Well, obviously not, if it keeps happening. So um, no, I think it, it comes down to guys working hard, being disciplined, um, practice, all of the above. You know, I think um, you know, it, it's hard, it's, it's not easy, it's not meant to be easy. Uh, and it, you know, as we've seen, test cricket tests people and individuals and teams in, in tough ways. So it takes a lot of character for us to, to come back from tough situations like this. Um, and rightly, when people... You know, um, say so it's been happening too often, which it has. So um, you know, guys have got to improve, and we know that as a side. And um, you know, to get to where we want to go, we, we need to eradicate these um, collapses. I, th I think the, the key is uh, trying to not make the same mistakes as well, I think. And, you know, that is learning. You can't keep doing the same thing over and over again, whether that's individual or as a team. You know, it's, there's, if there's an obvious weakness um, as an individual that you need to work on, or as a team, is there a, um, something? So if it's a similar thing, we need to make sure that that's not happening. Um, and and you know, hard work, there's no real substitutes for hard work, I think. Uh, it, we know in England uh, conditions can be tough and favourable for swing bowling. And credit to India as well. I thought they bowled, bowled very well um, and got the ball moving around. And, and we weren't good enough to deal with that today. Uh, so that's a, an obvious area where you know, there's no magic um, answer, I don't think, apart from hard work. Um, no, not really. I think um, just from watching Test cricket as a whole, I think um, you know it looks like when, when one side has that momentum, it seems hard to wrestle back. You know whether um, you know, we've obviously been on a real good side of that um, for the first part of the series. You know when we've been on top and we've managed to stay on top. Um, you know, I think it looks like size. It's hard to to get back into games at, at certain stages. Um, so, but there's nothing, you know, really is a, a fantastic um, atmosphere in the changing room. The group gels well together. There's a, a real good feel about it. Uh, and we're not, I think the obvious thing, we're not quite getting the results. Um, but it's not for a lack of trying or many um, obvious reasons that I can see from, from my time um, out the side to coming back in. Yeah, well, I think um, you know, experience tells you that there is no golden key to, to cricket or anything. Like I said, about hard work and, and um, you know, some sort of self-evaluation um, um, and as, the same as a team and, and trying to learn and, and you know, no one's perfect, human error, and we, we've got to 
be better. You know, everyone is striving to be the best they can be. Um, so it's not for the lack of trying. Um, but if, like I said, we've, we've played some very good cricket um, during this series. We are 2 0 up. We've had a very bad day today, um, but we will come back hard. That's a you know, trait of the character of the group um, that we will keep fighting. Oh, yeah, I don't, I'm not sure India are ever going to go anywhere. They're obviously the number one ranked side in the world and, and they're there for a reason. It's always going to be a very competitive series and just because they're 2 nil down, I don't think um, you know, we could have taken anything lightly. Um, you know, we, we probably didn't quite hit our straps as well as we would have liked to on the, the first morning with the ball as well. And you know, with, with winning the toss, it so it brings a little bit of pressure uh, to take wickets and, and we probably didn't quite... Um, execute as well as we would have liked, um, but you know, it, I think it's always going to be a competitive series against the number one ranked side in the in the world. So they were always going to come back hard at some point. Yeah, of course. Otherwise, you know, I think any professional sportsman um, and you know, your pride in playing for your country will turn up tomorrow and will be fighting hard. Uh, yeah, no, I think the, the dressing rooms stay pretty pretty level. Obviously, they get quieter when, when partnerships are developing and you're watching your guys scoring runs. It's, it's a good place to be. And, and in a collapse, obviously, people are, you know, it's, it's a quieter place to be. That's um, just the nature of it. But I don't think there's anything you can look in. Guys are still um, you know, have a chat. There's obviously the screens. You can see what's going on. People are talking, communicating what's going on. But we just weren't good enough to deal with it. There's a lot of them. I think there's some very honest conversations. I don't think um, there are many dressing rooms like there maybe used to be 20 years ago with shouting matches and um, people throwing things at each other. But um, <laughs> no, I think people are you know, with you know, hard-nosed sportsmen who want the best and want to win. So there's some definite honest conversations that, that go on around it.